it was Christmas time and my family decided to visit me here in Australia. My journey started on 24 December and the first part we visited is Melbourne. As we arrived in Melbourne, the first place we visited is Fitzroy Garden, which is located at the east side of Melbourne. The garden itself is quite big place to explore. The reason we are here is to visit one of the historical buildings, Cook Cottage. And just next to the Cook Cottage is Conservatory. After that, we have Christmas Eve dinner at Meat and Wine Co. Following up after the dinner, my dad and I went to Docklands to shoot sunset slash golden hour. The next day is Christmas Day, which is a very, very hot day. It is one of the hottest Christmas in Melbourne. We started the day by attending Mass at St. Patrick's Cathedral. Now after the mess, just around the area is Old Treasury Building and Parliament House. Because of Christmas, every shop in Melbourne is closed. So, we visited St Kilda in the middle of the heat, which is nevertheless still crowded with a lot of people in the beach. The next day after Christmas is Boxing Day. This is my first time experience Boxing Day here in Australia, and it is not as crowded as I expected. I didn't really do much shopping, and I just take this time to stroll around the city of Melbourne. And that's conclude our Melbourne journey. And the next stop is Gold Coast. We were spending three days and two nights in Gold Coast and just a typical Gold Coast visit. We exploring Surfer Paradise and Theme Park Movie World.
concludes our Gold Coast experience and the last stop is my second home, Sydney. The first stop is to see the iconic of Sydney, Sydney Opera House from the Mrs. McQuarrie chair. On the second day, we went to Blue Mountain Scenic World in Katumba, which is one of the most popular tourist destinations here in Sydney. We experienced all the three rides started from Skyway. Our second ride is Scenic Railway, which is the world's deepest railway that brings us down to the Scenic Walkway. Next part is we visited one of the most popular beach here in Sydney, Bondi Beach. The next day, we started by having breakfast at the grounds. The grounds is not only a cafe, in my opinion, it is a pretty big area that has some food stall, market, some open food court separated from the cafe, and overall, it's a good experience to visit the grounds of Alexandria. The next place is Fish Market, which is also a popular destination here in Sydney. It is really crowded when we came here, as it can be seen from this video. Now, moving on to the next day, we started by experiencing a ferry ride to Manly. After that, it is another ferry ride but more crowded to Darling Harbour. And that concludes the trip with my big family. Thanks guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe and watch more of my videos.